Hello and welcome to Infinity. Gradients are quite useful and I've shown them using on um, pixel layers, but there is a problem with that. Uh, let's show you. Let's go add a pixel layer here. Go to the gradient tool. I draw myself a gradient and do whatever. And I can change it, of course. But if I go away from this layer now, if I just go just even to the move tool, then I go back to the gradient tool, my control has gone. There's nothing I can do about it. I have to draw it again. Yeah. Go away from it. It's gone. This is because this is now just a pixel layer. It has drawn the pixels. However, there is an answer if you want to have a non-destructive approach. So let's get rid of that. And delete that layer. I'll just show it here quickly and then we'll do something a bit further. I'm going to do a rectangle. Oh, now let's just draw the rectangle here. There. And we'll draw the gradient. Do it from the corner here because we're going to use this in a minute. If I go away from this, like so I click on other things, do other stuff, I can come back to the gradient tool and rectangle tool and it's not there, but yeah, it's the gradient tool. Go to that and look. My control is still there. In other words, I can come back to this at a much later date and still change it, which is great. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to change this white one here to black. And I'm going to go over here to overlay. And what we've got now is got, because overlay makes where there's black, it makes it darker. Where there's grey, it makes it transparent. So as I do this, I've got a kind of vignette effectively out from the corner here. So I can turn, bring that out to there. Let's bring one from the other side as well, so I can emphasise this diagonal. And all I need to do is just duplicate this rectangle. In fact, I can hit Control J. And I've got two layers the same. See, it's emphasised the effect, but I can just drag this bit around here, put that in the far corner. There we go, snap. And bring this over here to bring this one in. And this one is still darker here. That's a bit dark over there, so I can change that rectangle. Or if in fact, I can just drag this outside. Here we go. Yeah, don't even have to touch opacity on that. And so we've got these effects here, which is dark coming in here and dark coming in here. And I can do other things with that as well. If I wanted to emphasize the effect, I can just duplicate the layer. Control J, see there's more. Control Z, too much. I could draw lightning down the middle and, and all sorts. So in other words, it's a very quick and easy way of doing what you did with a pixel layer, but with a shape, it gives it a lot more flexibility and it's non-destructive. That's it. Thank you very much for watching.